cold. It tastes like ramen. It tastes like those um, tonkotsu soup. You don't choose bread. You say you like that. No, no, wait, wait. You say you like this one. I haven't tried it. Okay. This is a mala bato mee. Yeah. yeah, this is a mala bato mee with mi gang. And then mine is the abalone bato mee. Oh, yeah, I cannot see. Abalone bato mee. But then, right, I call them to change to. Don't steal my abalone! Abalone. Abalone. <laughs> I changed their mee pok to uh, mee sua because I like mee sua more. So do not eat my abalone. Oh my god, that's not the mala. I think it's quite ma. But okay, we, while we let him deal with the mala numbness, let me tell you how good is this. If any of you would like to eat miswa, right, will agree with me that the beauty of miswa is that it's so delicious. But miswa just like melts in your mouth, eh? It's like okay lah, of course not like butter melt in your mouth, but it's so eh, like so how to say miswa. So airy, so nice. Very light. Um, I don't feel my soul leaving me now. Okay, we shall not be bothered about him. I love the amount of ingredients that they put in. A lot, right? Oh, like awesome. mountain. We have the slices of pork here. And then, tukan, braised mushroom. This is the shiitake kind. Besides that, they also have the canned mushroom kind. So there are two different kinds of mushroom. And then there is also... A ramen egg. Yes! A ramen egg, a molten egg. And of course, how can you miss bar chow mee without the zu yo, the pork lard? There is also one pork ball and fish ball. And of course, mine comes with a abalone. This is a pork ball, okay? Let me try, okay? Since you already finished yours, right? Do you remember how it tastes? I cannot remember, right? I remember. How? I remember everything. It's very chewy. Mm. And it's very handmade. You can tell that it's handmade. It's not those processed uh, pork ball that you get from like those mm. processed food yeah. area in the supermarket. And can you can um, taste the fibers fiber. of the pork. So it's not like, you know, Sometimes they add like starch and all those and like not natural like other processed stuff inside. But this one don't have and it has a little bit of ikan bilis taste. Yeah, like, they, I wrong. think they grind the ikan bilis and then they right. mix it with the meat and then they make the pork ball. Okay, so you know like some mala right is mm. it's, it's just pure numbness or pure spiciness. Don't have so the same way. Yeah, I don't have the fragrance. But what we have here, I believe is the lard. The lard actually creates a different depth of fragrance into yeah. the whole bowl of noodles. Actually, I got something to tell you now. The owner keeps saying that he looked like a Hong Kong actor. You know, he was like smiling from year to year down here. <laughs> Any of you think that you don't know which actor? I know which actor, but I don't oh, know no, his no. name. Your comment at the comments, okay? Like, 
the ten, very ten Hong Kong actor that always act as police one. Back to food, back, back to, to food. food. I want to try this. Okay, wait. I, I want to try this. I haven't food. tried yours leh. Come on, chin. This one is the volcano, spicy volcano mi kia soup. And according to the store owner, this spicy volcano mi kia soup is only sold at the Aokang branch. Yes, come down to Aokang. Ah. Yes, come down. Ah. Let me mix it. Oh, like the coffee, coffee shop name is called... Yifang, is it? Yihuat. Ah, Yihuat. Ah. Yihuat Yi Cafe. Yihuat Cafe. Woo! Okay, wait. Let me okay, try the soup first. Oh. It tastes like ramen. It tastes like those um tonkotsu soup. You want to choose bread? You say you like that. No, no, wait, wait, wait. You say you like this one. I haven't tried it. Can I say something? What? It's nicer to eat than ramen. Can I eat it? Because the mikia, right? Can I still, wait, the mikia still remain, retain the al danteness. Mm. Oh, that's so very nice. The pork, the pork. 10,000 years wait, wait, wait. later. The pork is super thin and big. So they have like very big slices. They are not like, they are very generous with their toppings and condiments. Can you just eat first? You can eat the abalone, I eat it. No, you give up the abalone. <laughs> you know when you go for, when you do the steamboat? It is so thin, it's like the shabu shabu kind. It's very tender. Mm. The soup is very nice. Especially on a rainy day, right? It's raining like crazy now. The soup like warms your heart. Warms the cockles. I feel that this place, right? They really put in a lot of effort in making the hawker store alone look very attractive and attracting the attention of anyone who just walked past. So, what do you think of the noodles? Which one's your favorite? Like, really? This is my favorite. The, the ramen. ramen. The no, actually not ramen. Uh, not spicy volcano mikia soup. Yeah, spicy volcano mikia soup. Why? Huh? Why? Why? Uh? I, I'm well, a rare soup person. Uh -huh. Even when I eat bak chor mee. Okay, so like the thing about bak chor mee is that you know you all know the famous anti-fire kind of soupy soupy with a lot of soft bak chor inside. Yeah, I like that kind because it's soup. La. I didn't put any chili for this because there's already chili. And I would say this chili is on par with uh, ramen stores? Yes, yes, it has that. And the soup base feels like those ramen, the pork soup. We finished already! Yes, it yes. was a very full, very scrumptious meal. Yes, thank you for giving me face. Yeah, yeah, and then coming all the way to okay. Haokang. Okay, so what do you think about this um, modernized bar chong? Mm, I think it's very creative. Mm. Uh, it's not something that you usually eat every day. Yes. But of course, the most important is it, it is affordable. Everybody yes. likes affordable food. Yeah. So you know when you go and eat ramen, you spend like ten dollars, twenty dollars on it. Here it's like you get the same quality of yes. ramen, but it's only six eighty. And the thing is, give me face blends both elements or both aspects very well together. So you don't feel like it is like you know, eh? How come it tastes so weird or yes. like? How come the mala don't match with the mikia? How come the yeah. tonkotsu broth don't match with the mi, like the mi pork or anything? Yeah, so you, mm. the thing, the best thing is that you can also change uh, your types of noodles. Yes, you don't have correct. to just be mikia, it can be mi pork. Yeah. It can be mi hoon, it can, can be, be miswa. Yeah, miswa, miswa, anti miswa. Only yeah. anti see miswa. No, it's not an anti <laughs> thing. Yeah, so I hope that you also give, give me face a try. Yes, and let us. It's located at Aokang, block okay. 681. Mm. Yeah. They have three more outlets? Yes, they have three more outlets. Mm. I think one is at um, Amokyo. The other two I'm not very sure, I can't yeah. really remember. So. Okay, go ahead and check it out. Wait, you can yeah. check out their Facebook page. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. And if you are curious, Kimmy Face is actually part of the Tender Fresh group. Yeah. Yeah, so like, you know, and they are planning to open a halal noodle, a halal Kimmy Face version. Oh, they, wait, they actually have already. Oh, oh, it's at the... the it's located at Clementi. Kopi Kadai. Kopi Kadai. Yeah. yeah. They have the gimme face but it's in halal version. So Muslim friends who wants to try, do go to Kopi Kadai and like try their noodles out. Uh, since this meal, you 
intro, I will intro you the next meal. You see Anna? Okay, on. Okay, bye. 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 See you. Your hand blocked.